act together here. Alright. Oh, I thought you were moving that quickly. Are we we're we're ready when you are. We're probably reading some minutes. Okay, I'll pause I on never that. Have that's true. Mm -hmm. That's all her stuff. You're so slow, that's the problem. I'm waiting until the camera goes on. I oh, wanna, stop, I don't stop. Wanna, I don't want to check you oh, without stop. the camera rolling. You, you have no check. He's still, he's still yeah. Check. <laughs> Speed check. Speed check. Okay, go ahead. Mac, everyone who knows you say you're a kid who just loves to have fun. Do you have fun making movies? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's fun. You know, it's fun, like, working with Ted because... You know, I always get to meet him in chess and cards, basketball, things like that. Could you do me a favor and move the bishop and take your knight? What's with the chess game? There, you guys do not play chess during the movie. We uh, played every second we had off screen. Kind of shakes you up there, doesn't it, Mac? No, no. I really. love taking your pieces on camera. <laughs> this is the best interview we've had all day, oh, really. Right, this is. Right, right. We're humming now. <laughs> Ted, in real life, you're the father of two daughters, uh, but in this film, you get to be, you get to have a son. Yeah. How is the relationship different or similar? My daughters don't hit me quite as much as Mac did. Wow. Uh oh, very good. Uh, he, he he moved <laughs> off camera, and that's not fair. I can't concentrate. Uh, sorry, uh, I don't know how to answer that. I. Um, you really seem to You know, I think you, I think you perhaps, unfortunately, I don't think this is necessarily right, but I think you examine yourself when you're the father of a son. You perhaps look and go, uh-oh, I better get my stuff together. Maybe you think of that faster when you have a son than when you do with your daughters. And I don't think that's a right thing, but maybe, hmm. maybe so. Switching gears a little bit, a few years ago, you were looking forward to your mid-40s as being the prime of your life. Yeah. Now I've... that you're here, I, I was right. The same way? Yeah, I was right. I was absolutely right. I think I got my stuff together over the last two years for the first time in my life, so I'm thrilled to be where I am. How about you, Matt? You happy where you're at? Yeah, I'm fine, you know. Just doing what I'm doing. Don't you wish you were 34 years older like me? Yeah. Oh, don't say that. that yeah. What do you do when you're not making movies? Because it seems you're always making movies. What do you do when you're not doing that or in school? Losing um, chess games? No, beating 10 chess. No. I'm um, just like hanging out with my friends and, you know, playing basketball, things like that. Uh -huh. You told me you were just in Nashville recently. Asheville. Oh, a oh, I don't care about Asheville. Oh, jeez. Okay, but Asheville's lovely. Oh, oh. <laughs> got that on camera? <laughs> really? Um, in the movie, you were doing a music video. I mean, that was all the music for when I was gro from when I was growing up. How did you like that music? It was fine. I liked it. Okay. It was good. You guys listen to that music now, though. 70s and 60s music is playing, right? A little bit, yeah. 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 I'll be quiet. <laughs> Next question, please. <laughs> Next question. What's new? What's coming up for you, Ted, after this movie? Uh, for me, <laughs> uh, I finished a film called Pontiac Moon with Mary Steenburgen, and that's coming out in the fall. I hope to uh, do a piece with David Mamet uh, for Turner, Turner Television. Mm -hmm. What helped you two guys connect? I mean, this is the first film you've done together, right? Was it yes. instantaneous? Um, pretty much, yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Ever since I've been in that first game of chess. And I got some respect for him, and we were off and running. <laughs> What's going on with you, Mac? Right now, I'm doing uh, Richie Rich. Yeah. In Asheville. You're doing extremely well as a child actor, and I don't know, you've probably heard the stories that child actors don't do so well later in life. Do you ever think beyond that? Do you want to continue acting? Uh, probably, yeah, or do some other stuff, you know, in the film, like directing or whatever. Your brothers are doing a lot now, too. Are you giving them pointers? Not really, no. We pretty much do our own thing. <laughs> what have you learned from Ted in acting? Well, how not to play chess mm -hmm. and not to, uh, no, actually, no, I, he's a hard worker and stuff like that, so, you know, bad basketball player, wouldn't you say? No, <laughs> I wouldn't. Oh, no, well, what if I, uh, no, said no. something? <laughs> You're horrible. I, was, I had a bad day, that's all. It was just a bad day. <laughs> Ted, you said you were really erratic in choosing some of your past films. Did I? I yes, think that, you said that. I think critics have said it. I didn't know I said it. <laughs> Why did you choose this particular one? Bum, 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 bum. Um, as a parent, I, you know, looking for movies to go to, I think this one was uh, is very funny. I think it appeals to kids, and yet 
as an adult, I'm interested because it had a, has a lot of heart and it has a morality that I, I like being around as a parent. I just got my wrap. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Good luck. I hope it does well for you. Thank you. It really was a nice feeling. Yeah, thanks. The feeling thanks. you know that I'll be back. Thanks, girl. When the do day you, is you, new.